Hey guys, General Mechanic right here. Oh, um, just a quick tip right here. This is a 3.5 Nissan engine. Goes on Maximus, Quest, uh, Murano, same thing. Just a quick tip right here. When you're removing the timing cover, um, don't worry about messing with this covers right here. The uh, the VVT ports right here. This thing, you don't have to touch them. All you gotta do is take all the 10 millimeters uh, bolts all the way around. Now, one thing, it is the reason of this video is that you do have to take the oil pan out. Why? You see this uh, this part right here on this side. There's two long bolts. There's one long and there's one short. This one right here is short. It goes from like from here in there. So these two are holding the uh, <coughs> timing cover from down here, and um, it's it's kind of hard to see them because you know you got to remove the timing cover off. I mean the opening off in order to get to those two bolts right there. One time, a uh, long time ago, I had a little struggle trying to pull it out of there because I had removed those two bolts right there. So it's a quick tip, guys, that is gonna be helpful when removing the front cover of the engine on a 3.5 Nissan engine. What we're doing right here is we're replacing the uh, timing guide with the tensioner, and uh, we should be good with the, to go with this thing right here. So don't forget, remove that thing so you can slide that, you'll be able to pull that timing cover off and, uh, you know, It'll be easy from that on before you break something. So thank you guys for taking the time to watch. Don't forget, this is a channel where we can find quick tips that is going to help us do the job a little easier. And if you if you find it helpful, don't forget, leave thumbs up. Maintain, subscribe as we got more videos coming. And as always, have a blessed day.